Yaman. Yeah, All right, Yaman. Yeah, Excuse you. Sorry about the young you, but um, not much to say. Well, wait a minute. What are we doing here? I'm actually going to be doing a book review for this movie called Bob Marley One Love. I is I mean, I know it's the end of the month of February, but I already uploaded my I already yeah. Well, I was gonna say I already did upload. I did at the end of January and then come up to YouTube part two. It's the beginning of this one. I don't have a lot to say about um, this, but this is a bow pick. Of, it's a Bob Marley bow pick. Courtesy of Paramount and Basically, I went to see this Arrigo and, uh, yeah, bear with me. And I apologize for yawning because I, uh, I'm feeling tired, so I just want to get this movie out of the way because I'm not going to go into much details with this movie, but, um, this pile pick is basically the guy who played Bob Marley, I think he nailed the role perfectly. I think, uh, Bob was supposed to. This movie is basically celebrating the life of Bob Marley, Jamaican musician, by the way. If anyone. A lot of people should be familiar that he is Jamaican. There was some troublesome day, days of um, being a Jamaican. Try to uh, have music. I mean, the music in this that appears like reggae music. I mean, yeah, it's pretty much. I mean, the cast were doing. I mean, the cast were spectacular. I mean, a lot of people love it. I mean, the only score. Okay. But yeah, this movie is um amazing. I pretty much enjoyed this one, but I haven't um I'm very late. It's only a few days late of brewing this after seeing this at theaters on Monday night. But I don't have much to say about this movie. But the fact that this movie is honoring uh the life of Bob Molly I'm pretty sure the book, the guy who played Bob Molly did great. I can admit that. It's a very entertaining movie if, uh, if you are a fan of Bob Marley. This movie is for you guys. Celebrating the life and music of Bob Marley really brings up, brings up to what the uh, reggae music comes in. I mean, this is reggae music. Reggae? I'm not sure if this is all about the reggae. It's about reggae music, but what music? I'm not sure of the music genre, but I think it is reggae. But correct me if it's not. I'm actually, yeah. It was a good pop pick drama. And yes, it is a musical, by the way. It's a Bob Pick taking it, taking on a musical because I've seen um, Bob Picks of uh, Star Is Born as well. Oh. There's a lot of Bob Picks. I've seen a very few Bob Picks. I've seen the Queen. I've seen the Queen one in theaters, but this is the most recent movie. I know it's the second movie we've done for 2024, and um, hopefully by the as we enter March, I'll get some more movie reviews on YouTube. But at the very least, I got one movie to uh, review as part of Black History Month. 
I'm actually going to review Do the Right Thing somewhere down once I uh, get to March. I mean, I was going to do a review for Do the Right Thing this month, but I never got the opportunity. But eventually, Do the Right Thing will be getting a full review. I'll do it once I am in Virginia, but not right now. But yeah, back to the one love. This movie was, um, yeah, I don't have much to say about this movie, but I personally, um, enjoyed it. Don't, don't get to listen to Reiki music as much, but the music was alright. I mean, the music was great, you know, but, um, I kind of find, uh, I think uh, I find this kind of genre of music underrated because I don't even give it a lot of appreciation. I mean, even the fact I rarely listen to the, the music that, this kind of music that appears in the, in the movie, but so many, so many songs, so many, I just, and the fact that Bob Marley died in the early 80s, I mean, it's kind of, he was in his 40s, I suppose, but may he rest in peace and God rest his soul. Hopefully his uh, legacy will continue to inspire other reggae musicians and other Jamaican those who are from Jamaica. I mean, he had his life try to get freedom in Jamaica, probably something he wanted to have happen. But yeah, he guess few will. Anyways, um. I'm gonna give this movie a four and a half out of five. Sobering and Bob Marley's legacy in the musical itself has, um, I was very impressed with this biopic. I may see it again in AMC, unless I see that other PG Bird movie, because, uh, I'll probably be eating up the Palisades Mall again on Friday. For Friday, but um, that's not important to me. Anyway, so um, that'll be it for this video. Sorry that I'm very. It's the man. I mean, well, the making this video. Tired, but um, be sure. I will be sure to continue the movie review trend on my uh. On YouTube, hopefully more will make their way to the movie sound channel. That this I'm going to be putting this up on the movie sound channel by the way. So the channel I mainly use is has a lot of it. I use for gaming videos for the most part, and the movie sound channel is dedicated to movie reviews. So going forward, I mean, as I stated before, more review channels will be on my movies on channel going forward. I mean, it's been like that for a while, but that's it for this movie review. I'm sorry I didn't have a lot to say about this biopic, but hey, it is what it was. It was what it was. It was great, but Hopefully I have a lot to say when I do do the right thing whatever uh, comes next shall see.